Hi guys, this is Megha Verma. Welcome to my channel. So in today's tutorial, we will learn how to design this email signature in Corel Pro. So without any delay, let's get started. So this is the size of our email signature. First we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a rectangle now we will set the size of the rectangle 1000 by 333 pixels now we will set the align of the rectangle first we will click on specified point then we will align center horizontally and align center vertically Now we will select the rectangle and we will drag like this then we will right click to make a copy Now we will select this rectangle and we will fill color and we will remove the outline by right click Now we will select the first rectangle and we will fill black color and we will remove the outline now we will select this rectangle and we will drag and again we will make one more copy by right click now we will fill white color in this rectangle now we will reduce the width of this rectangle now we will keep the width 500 Now we will select both the rectangles and we will set the align from the first we will click on selected object now we will align from left. Now we will make one more copy by drag and right click of this rectangle and we will place like this. Now we will give a black color to this rectangle. Now we will select the rectangle and we will set the align from the right and vertically now again we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw a square now we will set the size of the square 250 by 250 pixels now we will click on the chamfered corner option now we will select the shape tool from the toolbar and we will drag the corners Now we will make a corners flat Now we will select this shape and we will rotate on the 45 angle Now we will place on the rectangle Now we will decrease the size Now we will select the shape and the rectangle and we will set the align, align center horizontally and align center vertically. Now we will select the shape and we will make a copy by drag and right click. Now we will select the shape and we will fill black color in this shape and we will give a white color to the outline by right click now we will increase the size of the outline now we will make a copy by drag and right click
now we will give a black color to the outline of this shape we will place like this now we'll select both and we will right click then group now we'll select this shape and we will select the rectangle now we will set the align align center horizontally and align center vertically now we will import the image now we will decrease the size of the image now we will flip this image by mirror option now we will adjust the size of the image according to the shape now we will right click on the image then power clip inside now we will click on the shape now we will click on the edit now we will adjust the image now we'll click on finish now we'll select this and we will place here now we will remove the outline color now we'll select both and we will set the align first we will click on selected object then align center horizontally and vertically now we will select the text tool from the toolbar and we will write the name of the person I will give a bold look to the text. Now I will make a copy of the text by a drag and right click. Now we will change the color of the text. Now we will place this text like this. now we will select both the text and we will give a underline now again we will select the text tool from the toolbar now we will write the designation of the person and we will place here and we will give a bold look to this text now we have this icons so we will place this icons first we will place the social media icons here now we will place this contact details icons and the logo we will place logo here now we will place this icons
Now we will select the text tool and we will write the details. Now we will adjust the size and we will place here. Now we will make a copy of the text and we will edit the text. One by one we will write all the details. Now we will write the address. Now we will write email address. Now we will write the website. Now we will select all the details and we will set the align from the left. Now we will select all and we will adjust the size. Now we will select the rectangle tool from the toolbar and we will draw line like this with the rectangle tool. Now we will select the pick tool and we will remove the color. Now we will increase the size. Now we will click on the round corner option. Now we will select the shape tool and we will select these two nodes. Now we will round the corners. Now we will select this line and we will click on the interactive fill tool. Now we will apply on this line. Now we will set the colors. We will select the color with the color eyedropper tool. Now we will remove the outline color by right click. Now we will make one more copy of this line by drag and right click. Now we will select both. Now we will select both the lines and the rectangle. Now we will set the align from the left. Now we will select this line and we will decrease the size. Now we will select the interactive fill tool and we will change the color. Now we will select both the lines and we will make a copy by drag and right click. Now we will click on the option mirror horizontally. Now we will select the rectangle and the lines and we will set the align from the right. Now again we will select both the lines and we will click on the mirror option mirror vertically. Now we will adjust the text. So guys our email signature design is ready. I hope you like the design. If you have any question regarding this tutorial you can ask me on the comment box. Please like share and comments and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get updates of my videos. Thanks for watching.